Listen to my voice, young Yukel. Listen to the voice of a very dear friend, Kirk. You are the guide of your people. He who shows his Yukel brothers the path of modernity and progress. These archaic migrations that you persist in perpetuating are now but ridiculous reflexes. You must take your people back where they came from and have them settle down. Build real houses, schools, and factories. The nomadic life will no longer be possible in the world of tomorrow. If the American comes, Colonel? If she's actually mad enough to try and save her nomad friend, neutralize her without violence. We must send her to American justice in one piece, if possible. And... the young nomad? Olga Efimova is on it. I've met a lot of people in my life as a soldier, Colonel. I've seen things. And, Sergeant? Dr. Efimova gives me the shivers. Indeed, me too, soldier. Me too. A military device. Sarah was right. Judging by the equipment in there, those soldiers aren't joking around. From the looks of this mic, I bet the voice will be completely distorted. Dr. Olga Efimova. Come in. Over. What's wrong, Olga? Helmut thinks he saw the American lurking in the sick ward. I don't know what she's up to. You have to stop her as soon as you can. Is that idiot psychiatrist really sure? I'm sure we would have seen Kate Walker enter the clinic. 
Colonel, if you'd rather run the risk of letting that cow run free, it's up to you. I hope you're not disturbing us for nothing, Olga Efimova. What on earth happened here? Miss Walker, come quickly! Dr. Zamiatine, but what's going on? You were indeed right about Dr. Olga, Miss Walker. I didn't want to believe you. What they've done to my friend Steiner. And it's... It's all my fault. <sighs> if only I'd listened to you. This is not the time to talk about regrets, Dr. Zamiatine. Simply tell me what happened here. It's Olga. She has brought her soldier friends into the clinic. Just after Steiner fitted Kirk's prosthesis. Then the soldiers wanted to stop them from leaving. Steiner refused to listen to them. He kicked up a fuss. So they worked him over. My friend had an attack. Miss Walker. I'm here, Mr. Steiner. You... Have to save young Kirk. That woman, Olga, she's a real monster, you know. Your enemy and that, Colonel. Protect the Yukols from those criminals. Make sure they get to their destination. You can count on me, Mr. Steiner. What do you intend to do, Dr. Zamiatine? I'll take care of my friend Steiner, of course. The poor man needs help. I'm thinking of hiding him in a secret passage until the soldiers have left. But you, Miss Walker, hurry and help young Kirk. My dear Miss Walker, your medallion, the heart, you know, it's in very good condition. It contains a lot of essential data from an XZ-2000 automaton. Everything as it were. You understand, on that particular model, the heart and intelligence were intermingled. So then, it wouldn't take all that much for you to get your friend Oscar back one day. I... Yes, Mr. Steiner. Of course. I'll remember. There's a note stuck underneath. This travesty must weigh a ton. Oh, that banshee Olga took the time to tear up the coat, of course.
completely fascinated. Kirk? If you can hear me, please just listen to me. Your tribe needs you. The migration can't happen without you. <sighs> it's hopeless. Looks pretty solid. He's unconscious. I have to wake him up. Another one of Olga's neuroleptics. Who knows how much she injected? <laughs> 